In this video, we are going to walk through the different ways that you can add student comments in Skyward Cumulative. First, we're going to log into our account, make sure that we're in teacher access in the upper left, then open up that three bar menu and choose the grade book option and then open up grade sheet. Once we're in grade sheet, if you have multiple classes, you'll be prompted to select your class. So here we have access to two different classes. So we're gonna click on one to open up that option. And there are a few different ways that you can add comments either by class or individual. So you can see we've got a couple grading periods here and one of them shows a little comment icon. So that grading period with that student already has a comment in there. If you click on the grading period header, you can choose to add or edit comments for that grading period. Then you'll see your class list with drop downs for adding up to three comments from the comment bank selections. You can apply comments to the whole class and then go in and uh, personalize those selections for individual students, or you can go student by student and select from the drop down. You can also add a 50 character freeform comment and save that as well. You'll notice that the comments, when you add them from the dropdown, they just show the code. When you click on the student account, you'll be able to see which comments you have chosen if you need that refresher. So you click Save Changes at the top left when you're done, and those comments are now added and saved for that grading period. You can also click on the student name and click Comments on that left menu, and you'll be able to see the comments that have been saved or add comments. And here for this primary student, we have the option to add a free form comment, and then you'll need to save any changes once that has been added. So again, you can access individual comments. You can see now they have the comment icon by clicking on the student name from that grade sheet menu. So here we're gonna pop back into our history demo class, and we can click on the name of our demo student, click on comments, and you'll see the comments that we've already added are there, and we can see the code as well as the full comment. We can edit and add an additional comment here. We can change any of those comments and then click Save Changes at the top. And then that new comment will be applied to that student's profile. So you can select individual students and click comments to add those, or you can click on the grading period header and choose add edit comments for that grading period to fill out the comments whole class. So individual within their profile, or you can choose to go by class and choose the grading period at the top.